Hello, this is Michelle Knight. This is the astrological update for tourists for the week starting the 14th of May. Now, this week there is a very powerful solar eclipse and also a new moon. And for you, it's all about your sense of security. Now, you're the sort of person that likes security and routine is very important to you. However, this new moon is offering you a gift. It's saying to you, you can do things differently. You can transform and you can look at things another way. In fact, you might have a fabulous idea on how to follow your soul or you may see something that you feel is a fated path for you. I'm not one of those kind of astrologers that believes in fate. I believe we create our own reality and our own fate. But there are certain things in our life that are destined to give us opportunities to take us down a new road. And this could be the week where that happens for you. Now be a bit careful though, because it's squaring Neptune, the planet of illusion. And that's a connected to your 11th house of friendship. So if a friend says something to you and you know in your gut it's not the right thing for you, then ignore it. Or if you feel that something is absolutely right for you, but a friend is poo-pooing it, then ignore them because you must trust your instincts this week. There's also Venus, the planet of love, is going retrograde, it's going backwards, and that's also in your second house. So in a way, you're looking at the past, you're looking at commitments you've made in relationships. You may even be thinking about things that you changed in relationships at some point in your life. You may be looking back to a past relationship, or you may want to go to the beginning and rewrite the rules. Either way, you are feeling in your power. It's trining Saturn in your sixth house. So you're looking at the finer details to make something really work for you. And you're able to break a pattern and step forward. If you're single, it's the opportunity for you to have a new start in the way that you see relationships. And it could be that there's some communication with an ex-lover this week. Take care and I'll speak to you soon.